Hi, let me introduce. This is the water-powered clock which do not need to run on battery. All you need to do is open up the cap and fill in it with water. You will be able to see a minimum water level and a maximum water level. The water level fill should maintain between the two lines. Once the water has been filled, please close the cap. Coming back to the main screen, you will be able to see two mode buttons on your right and two set buttons on the left. Press both the mode button at the same time. The screen will now show the date, followed by the time. Both the date and time will loop in every two seconds. Moving on, press the mode button again. The screen is now ready to edit the month. Press the set button at the same time in order to edit the month. Once the month has been set, press the mode buttons once again. The screen is now ready to edit the date. And of course, press both the set buttons in order to change the date. Keep pressing until you have selected the right date. Once again, you will press both the mode button. The screen is now ready to edit the hour. It is 2 a.m. now. Keep pressing the set button. And now you will see it's showing alphabet P, which means it is p.m. The time has been set at 2 p.m. Once the hour is set, press the mode button again. The screen is now ready to edit the minutes. And of course, keep pressing the set buttons to select the correct time. Uh, sorry, the correct minute. Last but not least, press both the mode buttons one last time. The screen will now go back to the main view. This is the end of the briefing. To redo the setting, please start from the very beginning. Thank you.